Good morning. Happy Friday. Cassian is 11 months today. <laughs> I can't believe it. He's 11 months. Ooh, we gave him a haircut yesterday. Don't look back here. Justin made me cut his mullet, but I did not want to. It was so cute. So on the right, I kind of messed up, but on the sides, it looks pretty good. And it's so cute because it was like getting onto his ears and he kept scratching his ears. So we cut the sides. He looks like a little toddler. Oh, what's wrong? Are you rubbing your eyes? Oh my gosh, rubbing your eyes, so cute. But yeah, his haircut. I didn't touch up here though. Just the sides really, because he was not having it. Oh. Yesterday, or I'm standing because he's not having it. This morning, he woke up at 5.15. He was actually up for 30 minutes. I watched our camera. He was up for 30 minutes before I went to go get him because he didn't cry until like towards the 30 minutes. And then I went in, I nursed him, and I rocked him, and I wanted him to fall back asleep. And luckily he did. He fell back to sleep for an hour and a half, but I was just on the rocking chair with him because I didn't want to try to put him back into his crib in case he started crying again. So I was just rocking, falling in and out of sleep on the rocker with him. And then at 7.45 we woke up and we went back into our bedroom. Justin let me sleep for, I don't even know how long I slept, but he brought breakfast for me. Him and Cass came in with breakfast and it was so yummy. I'll enter a picture here. Yeah, it was so good. It's a little, or it was raining over, like it was raining last night. So it's pretty cold this morning, but the sun is out again. Cassian's wearing sweatpants and a long sleeve. I wanted to put him in his daddy's mini sweater um, later, but I think it's okay for now. Sorry, his smiley face shirt. <laughs> Are you happy? You're so happy. Yeah, I can't believe it's 11 months. We have to do his photos today. Oh shoot, we have to go to 85 or like get a cake today. And then, oh, I had a, well, luckily he did wake up at five because at 5.30 in the morning, I had a Princess Polly package that arrived at our door. And I'm like, bro, who is up this early to get this package? Luckily I was or else it would be stolen. Well, maybe it'd be stolen, but yeah, I got the package before I went to his room. Thank goodness I got it because it was in the rain. It was pouring rain too. Do you want to open Mama's package with me? <laughs> oh, 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 okay. This package it is heavy. Also, I don't know if I said in this video, but Cassian has been throwing the ball and playing fetch with Kilo and he just turned 11 months. His adjusted age is 10 months. So like, is he gonna be an athlete or what? Because I feel like babies don't throw until, I don't know, like 18 months or something. But he's so good at throwing. It doesn't go very far, but you know, still. Ooh, cute. Let me show you the shoes first. I got these shoes. It's like so spring. I've always wanted these. I guess they're like sandals. Wait, let me go a little higher. Um, I've always wanted these sandals, but I just never got it. But they're like, I don't even know what these are called, like mules? I don't know, they have a heel, like a chunky platform. How cute is this? I thought this was perfect for spring. Oh, purr. No. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. <laughs> you are way. So comfy too. The next thing is like little PJ set that I also always wanted and I just never got it myself. But it's this, let's see. This is the top, how pretty, little florals and ruffles. And this is like a waffle material. And it came with these shorts. How cute is that? So it's like a little PJ set. I have always wanted to wear one of these. I'm always a big t-shirt girl with like shorts. I thought I'd switch it up with this. This is oh, so soft too. Next is this top, very spring too. How cute, it has lace on top right here. That is so flowy and cute for spring. Can't wait to like go to a picnic or something with that. Okay, next is another top that's similar to the one I just showed, but in yellow. It would have been like cute for like Easter or something. I don't know. But this one, it also has lace on top with the little bow and then the corset. I love when it dips down like this. 
I think it's so pretty and I love wearing yellow, so this was like perfect for spring. The next is this. I actually have this in white, but I wanted to get it in black too because it's so comfy. I love just throwing this on. But I got this one in a size two. Usually I'm, I wear a size four, but I feel like it's pretty stretchy, so I got it in a two this time. And it ha it's a button here, sorry. Buttons. Things. And I got a pair of jeans. I have so many jeans already, but this one has like pockets on the side, like cargo pants jeans. I don't know. How cool are these pants? That is sick. Oh my gosh, this looks big. I like really need to go alter my pants. Ooh, these are so cool. Okay. I need to go to alteration <laughs> to alter this. The last is this dress. So pretty. It's a rib. This is like a, I want to say it's like a olive army green. Actually, no, this is like khaki. <laughs> and it's just a maxi dress. How pretty is that? And it looks so comfy. Yeah, this is stunning. Oh, I got two more things. They're just like accessories though. These socks I got because they look so cute with like Uggs. These, they're like little shrug leg warmers. If you know, and you put it like on top of your Uggs, so cute. The last thing is earrings. They're such pretty earrings. Look at this. Wait, how do I do this? Oh my gosh, you can't tell me that is not the prettiest little earring. It's a little bow with hearts. Oh, so cute. And that is all such a cute little spring Princess Polly haul and I have to do a TikTok for them. But yeah, I'm so excited about this and I gotta clean up and I will take you guys along for the wet the rest of our day slash weekend because it is technically my weekend now and I will show you guys what we get up to. I did my makeup. Cassian actually only slept 45 minutes and yeah, that is so short. He never sleeps that short in his first nap, but it's okay. We are going to take his photos now, his 11 month photos, and then we're gonna go out. This is the first month where we don't have the bed. So I put the bed sheets on the ground so that it'll look the same. Kilo's currently laying on it, but yeah, there's no bed, so we gotta make this work. And hopefully the lighting is good. Oh my gosh, I just did that one, and I forgot to video it because Kilo was trying to get in it, and now I'm sweating. Why do I always sweat when I do these videos? Life goes up and it goes down. I know my mom taught me that. I figured why we fool around so little, and we keep track of time. Being so serious, idiots Thinking it will matter, keep me company downtown Before the clock runs out Sun is shining but the rain is falling. This is so hard when he's actually mobile <laughs> I think, I think it's fine oh, I'm sweating! I've changed, so this is my outfit today. I'm wearing the little set that I got from Shein. It's a long sleeve with these like yoga pants. This is seriously so comfy. And then a puffer jacket because it's really windy outside. And I'm really hot right now, so we'll see how that works out. Um, but yeah, this jacket's also from Shein. It was with the collab that I did with them. So yeah, this is my fit. Oh, ignore that. That's my little octo magnet for my phone, but yeah, let's go. We are in the car now. Oh man, every time I talk, he cries. Because he knows I'm back here or I'm over here. Picked up some seven leaves. I'm so thirsty, so so glad we got this. I got a sea cream jasmine tea. Let me do this later. I gave Cassie a snack and just did my Amazon returns so now I can talk and be louder so he won't cry but we also picked up his 11 month cake this is a mango sponge cake and I was actually gonna get a fruit tart but then I realized the fruit tart is smaller so I don't think I'd be able to put two like one one candles on it so we have this one which is bigger so that I can like put it on each side looks good though and now we're going to a thrift store and they have like more so like streetwear type of clothes. So let's see if they have anything good. I wish they have stuff for like babies, but I don't think they do. You guys, I haven't been vlogging. Oh wait, I think this is 
Just the bathroom. Can we go that way? Um, we just went to a thrift shop, got a few things, so I'll show you guys that later. What else have we done? Can you go this way? Oh no, this is the floor. Yeah, this is the wrong way. Cassie was being fussy, so Justin has to hold him. We made it home. Cassian is currently napping and I'm really tired so I think I'm also going to take a nap and I'll be back later to show you guys what we got at the thrift store. I almost fell asleep in the car. I'm so tired. It is dinner time now. I said I was going to take a nap and I never napped because I was just editing TikToks the whole time he was napping and I wanted to post them today because they're about his 11 months so I have to post it today. But Justin made dinner and it smells so good. Cassian actually slept a long time, like almost two hours. I had to wake him because I didn't want him to sleep like too late. But let me show you dinner and then I'll show you my package also later. Oh, and we have to do our 11 months cake later too. So much to do. But here is dinner. Oh my goodness. Kilo. Sesame udon noodles. Looks good. Here is Cassie's little bowl. And some cucumbers that he made yesterday. Actually, I'm sorry, two, a few days ago. Spicy cucumbers. <laughs> Let's try this. Cheers. Mmm. 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 That is so good. <laughs> Look at all the juice. <laughs> his candles I can't believe it he's 11 months he has been like laughing so much though it's so cute okay I'm going to go put this away and then not sure what I'm gonna do for the rest of the night oh I'll show you my package actually so cute my flowers are dead I need to throw those away so I got a package from the foxy kind and I've heard like great things about this brand and how their clothes are so soft. They're like made for like moms. Um, well, not just moms, but like everybody, but it's super comfortable for moms and for when you're pregnant. So when they reached out, I was so excited because I've always wanted to try it, but it's a little pricey. I think one whole set is like $100. So they have a ton of colors for this. You know. But I got the color called Biscotti, which is like a tan. Okay, here is my first impression feel. Ooh, ooh, this feels nice. So it's supposed to be like really baggy and oversized. Oh, this is like pretty heavy. Oh my gosh, you already see how stretchy this is? This looks so comfy. Yeah, it's like huge. It's supposed to look really big. And then it came with these biker shorts, which feel very comfy. I see why pregnant girls like to wear this because it's really soft and stretchy. I just put it on and I see what they mean on how comfy this is. This oversized shirt, it literally feels like I'm not wearing anything. And then these shorts, they like don't, what's it called? They're not too tight at your waist because sometimes when I like sit down, biker shorts like this or just like shorts like this, it usually like sucks you in and it's like very uncomfortable when you sit down and I don't like that feeling of like the elastic, but this one, you cannot feel it. Wait, hold on, I need to put you lower. So freaking comfy. Oh my gosh, I love how big this is. And I see people like tucking it too, like this if you wanted to but I'm about to like live in this. This is so comfy. Yay! I think actually they might have given me a code. Let me see. Oh yes, they did give me a code. It's Melody15. I'll put it right here. You guys have to get this. I know it's a little pricey, but I see why. If you just like lounge around the house or like you work from home or something like that. So cute too. Good morning, happy Saturday. I think I didn't end the vlog yesterday, so sorry. We didn't do much after 
dinner. I did a lot of his birthday things, so I think there's nothing to vlog, so... Yeah, I ordered a bunch of stuff and I have things coming in today which I'm super excited about because this one's gonna be a surprise for my friends and people that are coming. So yeah, it's gonna be a surprise but it's coming in today. Yeah, we are heading out to get coffee this morning. We're gonna go to this new place that I've been seeing on Instagram and it's really, really cute. So hopefully there's not too many people because I feel like it's been blowing up a little. I'm always wearing the same sweater set because it's just so comfy and then Cassie's wearing the same set he did yesterday <laughs> because it's pretty cold outside. It's like 44 degrees which is freezing here. So yeah, he's gotta be cozy. Look at his outfit. It is so cute. He has hiccups too. Why do you do your hair? Oh, you want the camera. Okay, let's go. You guys, he is making a huge mess, but he is loving it. And I feel like he's gonna be on a sugar high. <laughs> that is so cute. Cassie, um um. Come mama, um um. Um um. He's like, no. Oh, he ate it all. Yeah. This lighting is not very good. Oh, I'll be back. Actually, this lighting is not good. Oh my gosh, I was going to vlog earlier and then I totally forgot, but we've been home for a while. This is so yummy, oh my goodness. I feel like I can't finish it though because it's pretty um, strong and sweet. So yummy, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it for tomorrow when I have work in the morning. And then I'm also washing my Foxy Kind shirt uh, because I feel like Cassie slime went all over it. And I still didn't even do the video yet. And there was slobber on it and it wasn't getting out even when it dried. So I washed it, but let's see if, let's see if it even came off. Oh no, <laughs> that is not gonna work. Maybe I have to put you in. <laughs> you in the laundry okay you're in my laundry this is the shirt i washed it said i had to tumble on low so it's still wet but i think it came off it was like all up here the saliva so i'm gonna tumble it again two oh shoot i gotta dry it longer what the heck it says tumble dry low but it literally takes forever okay so while he's napping, did he suck my chin? <laughs> Looked like I had a hickey here from him. I want to do my lashes to show you guys. I've taken my lash off for like a week to let it rest, but I also need to clean my room. Um, I'll show you guys later. Typically I use, I'm gonna butcher this name. Vayas Beauty Lashes, VS, Vayas, um, but Lily Lashes sent me a couple of lashes, so I wanted to try out their brand, but for her side, this is so messy, I have to do my Shein collab here. I also need to put this away because I'm actually listing, I'm listing this on Poshmark, so there's like Opali, Bowen Tee, there's some Nike white box stuff, so if you guys are interested in my Poshmark, um, I'm gonna leave it here and it's always in my description down below like this Nike shirt still has a tag on it so I need to do that um, in a little bit literally I never close this I'm just in a chatty mood today telling you guys what I need to do this keeps falling off okay I have these compact little things but I don't think it sticks very well because of my wall like the feeling of my wall it's not flat like for example this well this is same and that flat but it literally won't stay on and it keeps oops it keeps coming off here and it's really annoying so if you guys have any tips let me know on how to keep that in place and then also i want to get rid of this because there's just so messy um, i used to put my purses here but then now i feel like it doesn't look very good so i need to figure out on what I should do with that. And I also wanna list some of my shoes, like some of these heels that I have not worn in a long time because I feel like I don't really go out like that anymore. So I don't really need those shoes or heels, I mean. But anyways, I'm just blabbering on. Let's go downstairs to do my lashes. I'm back downstairs. This is the lashes that I'm gonna try. 
It's the secret agent one. Secret agent. There's a lash bond and a lash top coat for a sealer. And then, oh, they also give you adhesive remover, which is really cool. I've never seen this in an actual um, one of these, like an adhesive, usually, or an adhesive remover that looks like a gel. I feel like usually it's like an oil. And it came with a little tool to help and it has a comb, which is cool. I've never seen that. Let's try it. Let's see with the tray at an angle. So it comes with medium on top here. You can't even see this medium and then long. I think I'm going to do medium just because these were more so everyday lashes. And if I want to like go out or I'm going somewhere, I'll do, I'll do the long. Oh, well, thanks. Justin gave me some pistachios because I don't really eat breakfast. Okay, let's try this. Wait, this is so interesting. This is the first one where I see there's like, it's kind of like a ballpoint top. Wait, can you see that? Okay, there you go. It's like a ballpoint. Usually it's just the bristles, but this is pretty cool. All things must pass. But I'm not gonna wake up, wake up. I'm not ready, let me have another day. Don't wake up, wake up. Keep it steady, cause I'm happy, I'm not gonna wake up. No, no, not yet. Whoa, no, not yet. Whoa, no, no, not yet. Whoa. I'm afraid I'll end up nowhere. They keep saying. In one side it looks pretty cute I feel like they're shorter than I usually do so maybe I should have gone with the long but I like how like little and natural oh wait that stuck sorry <laughs> I think it needs to dry still but I like how like natural it looks if you can see now I have to seal it with this don't need another view time is not on my mind but then it's you oh I love it when the love comes around and then I remember all things must Kathy pass. woke up. Okay, but anyways, this is one. I'm gonna do the other, so I will come back when they're both done. I am in my room now. I just put on both of the lashes. They look pretty good. They look pretty like wispy. I feel like they're more wispy than, oh my god, he grabbed my camera, than the other ones that I use, the Vey Yes ones. If that's what it's called. I'll have it in my storefront if you guys are interested in it. I put mediums on, but I feel like mediums are more like natural um and i feel like i'm just used to like longer ones so maybe next time i'll use the long one but i really like it actually looks good but anyways we are in my room i just nursed cassie we're gonna go out to this market um it's the same place where we went yesterday but there's like an actual market today and there's like little shops, um, like small businesses. He's just watching me talk. Small businesses, there's like food vendors and things. So I think we're gonna go there to check it out. Just a little fun activity for the day. <laughs> what is he doing? He's so silly. What are you doing here? He loves just having things in his mouth and like crawling around with it. Like for example, this piece of paper. <laughs> um, okay. All right, let's get ready really quickly. I feel like I'm gonna do like a hopefully five-ish minutes makeup. I don't think I wanna put on foundation today cause we're not doing much. So I think I'm just gonna put on like my contour and my eyebrows and what's the other thing? Blush and then I'll pretty much be done because my lashes are on already. Let's put you guys here. Hopefully he doesn't grab it and Let's see how long this takes. Okay, let's go. I'm going out with you tonight. Are you close to here? Mm -hmm. I'm feeling down. I don't know why. No, know it's so surreal. I think I want you here. Yeah. Oh, 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 o
done with my makeup. He literally took everything out of my makeup bag. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's put it back. Clean up, clean up, everybody everywhere. Clean up, clean up, everybody do your share. Crazy boy. And he's gonna take my camera. Oh, oh no, no, okay, Um, we'll be back. Really quickly before we head out, this is my outfit. I did the long sleeve from Princess Polly. It's so comfy. And then I'm doing a puffer jacket because it is pretty chilly outside. So I think I'm gonna need this and if I get hot, I'll take it off. These are the pants from Princess Polly, but they're super long. So I'm they're probably gonna drag on the ground and can't really do anything about it. This is Cassie's outfit. He's doing a little graphic sweater set. This is so dang cute. And then we're gonna bring his varsity jacket because it's a little chilly and I feel like if he just wears this, he'll be a little cold. But we're gonna put this on when we get there. Okay, let's go. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> I didn't end up wearing my jacket because it's actually kind of hot. Oh my gosh, you guys, we literally went to go eat lunch and I forgot to vlog because I was doing a TikTok. Fail. But we're going back to the Charms because I wanted to get a bracelet. So let's see what I end up wearing. Hi guys, it's been a while since I saw you guys. I took a nap. Cassian took a nap. He woke up from his nap around literally the same time I woke up. So I woke up first and then he woke up like two minutes later. I wanted to show you guys what I got at the thrift store yesterday. So the first thing is this Drew shirt, which is pretty cool. I think, you smell it? He's <laughs> Cassie's pooping, so we left him over there. We're like, okay, let's not bother him. So the, this is the first Drew, the first shirt. Yeah, I don't really own, I've never owned a Drew item. This was 23, it's an extra large. So I think this would be perfect for a sleep shirt. That's like what I got it for. And then Justin got this Dragon Ball Z shirt. At first I showed it to him and he didn't want it. And then I see him over there while we're almost leaving getting it. He said he had to think about it. But yeah, this was pretty cool. And then he got this vest. Oh shoot, wait, the Dragon Ball Z shirt was seven bucks. And this is a vest that he got. He's in his dad era. So he got this vest. This was $33 from the brand Gromichi Taeyon. Never heard of, of it before. I that. Yeah, I don't know. Well, have you heard of it? No. And then as I was leaving the store, I already paid. I saw a sweetener shirt because I didn't go to that section because I was with the stroller and it was kind of overwhelming because the stroller was really big and I couldn't get into places. So I didn't really want to walk around that much. This shirt, how cute is this one? It's Ariana with her sweetener like a concert, like that's the name of the concert or her album. Um, so this is from there. This was 19 bucks. So this was sweetener, thank you, next. And did I go? I did go to this concert. I, I have like other, other merch from her concert. I think I have two things from her concert that year and I went three times, I think. I think it was the sweetener one, I forget. But yeah, so cool. Well, I saw her three times. So I one time at Coachella, one time at Chase Center in SF. And the other one I think was Oakland. Oakland or somewhere, I forget. I think so. I, d I remember going three times to see her. I remember you went to Chase. I was jealous because... You wanted to I, go. Well, no, I was, that's when I just moved to LA. Oh. Um, but yeah, exciting. And I'm waiting for her tour dates for Eternal Sunshine because I really think that's my favorite album of hers. And it's so good. Anyways, that's all. Oh, wait, let me show you what I got actually today. My charm. So I got charm bracelet. I've always wanted a charm bracelet and I just so happened to see they had it there. So let me show you what I picked out. This little charm bracelet. Why does this look so tiny? Like this is Cassian's um, bracelet. <laughs> But it looks like this. I got, let's see, I got a mama, number five for Cassian because he was born on May 5th, Friday, May 5th. 
So he's my little 555 baby. I got a Libra, of course. I got a two because that's my favorite number. And then, oh wait, oh there, you can't see. There's like little rhinestones on it. The same one as the five. And then I got a little rose for Melrose. How cute. Let me try this on. I think this was like 60, it was like five, no. It ranged from seven to 12 for these little charms. And then I think the bracelet itself was $15. So I think I bought it for around 60 from what I can remember. Oh my gosh, I didn't even realize there's a freaking Libra sign on the back of this one. I thought it was just this. Yay. Yeah. Cute. Oh my gosh, I love it. How cute is that? I've always wanted a charm one like this. Ah, yay! I love it. And then I think if I ever wanted to, I can like add more onto it. Yay! I got my friends some cats because I saw this store that they had really cute cat stuff. And I thought this was perfect for them. This one is a little cat that has like a boba drink. And then that one goes with, I believe this one because her cat, her other cat kind of looks like this. And then my other friend, I got her one of these. It's very similar to the other one, but a little bit different colored. These are magnets. And then I got her one of these because she goes to the gym a lot and she has another cat that looks like this. Super, super cute. Kitten soul and gym cat. We are eating dinner now. We're doing sesame noodles again. We are letting Cass eat himself today, so we're putting like a little at a time, and it's kind of wet, so this might get a little messy, but I think he should learn how to do it himself to practice. He doesn't really know how to use a spoon yet, though, or a fork, so I don't know when they actually start. We have a little like first, what is it called, first use baby fork thing. Um, and it kind of dips like that so they can scoop it, but I don't know when he'll even be able to. I feel like he just likes to use his hands. Hi guys, I just put Cassie into bed. I'm eating my cookie. I just didn't put him to bed. We haven't really been doing much ever since we finished dinner. He ate his whole dinner. He ate so much and it was so messy because we let him eat and yeah, he got it like all over his arms and everywhere. But I still think it's so cute when he eats himself. Oh wait, another thing. I don't know if I said already, but I got the thing for Cassian's birthday that we're surprising our guests with, but they did it incorrectly. So I'm reaching out to them again to see if they can resend it and do it correctly this time. But yeah, that is all. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Good morning guys. Happy Sunday. Justin and Cassian and Kilo went out without telling me and I literally went to the garage to put his old clothes away and I was like, wait, you, they told me they were going on a walk but then the car is gone and the stroller is still there so I was so confused. Dude, you didn't and tell me where you were going. Yeah, you were complaining. They're back. You were complaining. I didn't get any work done so I took them out. Mm, oh yeah, he has been super whiny today, like my whole, the whole time I've been working because his teeth hurt. I've never heard him whine so much. Oh my gosh, my cutie baby. Did you have a good time? Ah, <laughs> my baby. You got in and out for mama? We'll be back. I got in and out. Woo! Hi guys. I just finished work. Cassian actually like halfway through my work day. He's been like super super fussy and whiny like that. And we think he might have like a little bit of a fever. I think from his teething, like a mild temperature from it. Oh yeah, my poor baby. He did a contact nap with Justin earlier for like an hour and 15 minutes. Ooh, his first nap was kind of short too. Like, only 47 minutes and bedtime supposed to be around 6 40 today which is so early he's never slept that early so we'll see what happens but um i just made some eggplant parm like shell pastries these are from trader joe's 
I've never had it before and we've had it in our freezer for a really long time. So I was like, let me pop it in the air fryer and just like try it. He wants it, but I need it to cool down first. I'm gonna eat the one that is already a little open. This is what the inside looks like. Oh, can you see? Like that. Oh, it's kind of hard. It's focusing on our faces. Mmm. Oh my gosh, so crispy. Mmm. Mmm. That's pretty good, actually. Be careful. He hasn't really wanting wanted to eat. Um, I think maybe because he's teething, he didn't want his lunch. So maybe he'll enjoy this little snack. Oh, here's a better one. That's what the other half looks like. If you can see it, right here. Oh, not really. Sorry. Bye. Right. I'll see you guys later. It is a little bit later. We're about to eat dinner. Cassian has not been very happy today. His teeth are hurting him. We both made some dinner. We're doing healthy tonight. So we got asparagus, salmon, and potatoes. And I eat my asparagus with QP mayo. So good. And we also have some ketchup. <laughs> it is 7.15 and Cassian is already asleep. This is the earliest he's ever gone down. We never go before like eight o'clock. And I'm just shook because, well one, I just, I don't think he's feeling really good. Yeah, I think he went to sleep because he doesn't feel well. I'm just a little nervous for tonight. Since it's so early, is he gonna wake up in like a few hours or is he gonna sleep all the way up until tomorrow morning? Is he gonna wake up at four or five or is he gonna sleep all the way until six? So yeah, not sure. This is so weird that it's only seven o'clock and I'm like, what do I do now? But I know I have a lot of things to edit. I will tell you guys how the night goes tomorrow and then I'll end the vlog and then restart tomorrow. Okay, good night. Hi guys, good morning. It is the next day from when I said I was gonna update you guys on Cassian's sleep last night. So when I logged off with you guys, it was around 7.15, right? And then he actually woke up around eight, I think it was, and I was freaking out a little bit. I almost went up to get him because he was crying for a little, but I was like, no, let me just wait a little bit longer. And luckily he did fall back asleep, but then he woke up again at around 9.30 and I was like, oh, heck no. Because if he, woke, if he woke up at like those two times, I don't know if he'd fall back asleep. But thankfully he did fall back asleep quicker than the eight o'clock wake up. He just like whined a little, cried and then fell back asleep. And then he didn't wake up until like 6.45, which, oh my goodness, that's the longest stretch he's ever done. Well, he did technically have those two wake ups that I actually don't remember how long they were. I think the first wake up was like 10, 15 minutes. The second one was like maybe five minutes. But yeah, that was the longest stretch of 11 hours and 40 minutes. That's the longest he's ever consistently, I mean, not, it's not, it wasn't constant, but I guess stayed in bed for. So happy about that. He is feeling a little bit better from his temperature yesterday, um, but he is still really fussy and super clingy to me today. Like this morning, I could barely get any work done. He just wanted me to hold him. My battery died, but I just put a new one in. Thank you guys for watching this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye. You found a different side of me. The one I'd like to be. A different side of me, yeah.